And while you may not be thinking about mosquitoes, and although the temperatures are still pretty cool, it may be the time to start. And that's according to local officials. <laughs> Riley Fitzgerald joins us now live in studio. Good morning, Riley. What do people need to know about mosquito control season? Good morning, Jessica. Mosquito control season I learned lasts from April through September and that's when you're going to see the most activity. That's also when mosquito control teams are going to be out checking standing water and treating mosquitoes when they're in the more immature stage before they become potentially disease carrying adults. According to the Benton County Mosquito Control District, you'll see employees out on the sides of roads or even checking backyards to test water. Angela Beeler, the district manager with the Benton County Mosquito Control District, says right now is the time to take care of your property to make sure you can prevent those bugs from hanging out later on. Get their standing water out of the yard. As we're doing kind of that spring cleaning, um, you might have puddles in the yard or sprinklers that need to be fixed, tires, um, anything that's holding standing water. If we can get rid of that, then we're going to get rid of the mosquitoes. Beeler says a large number of mosquitoes come out usually at the end of May, beginning of June, depending on the river levels. The more water, the more bugs. She also says last year there was a large amount of West Nile virus found in local pools of water. And while there were only five cases in 2022, 2023 saw around 40 cases. She doesn't have an estimate on how many cases of West Nile virus there are going to be heading into 2024, but she says there's a 100% chance that we will be seeing mosquitoes. We are always going to have mosquitoes in this area. Uh, the mosquito transmitted diseases like West Nile virus are endemic in the area. It's a hot spot um, when you look at the state of Washington, Benton and Yakima County. We're always going to have activities, so we're always looking at it, always trying to prevent it. Um, it's not a matter of if, but when we'll get it during the season. Beeler says there's a lot of returning staff this year, and they're only looking for a small amount of new people to join the team for the peak mosquito season. And if you're interested in learning more about applying, learning more about mosquitoes, or the annual tire drive happening in April, where you can bring your old tires to the Mosquito Control District for free, Check out our article on applevalleynewsnow.com. In studio, I'm Riley Fitzgerald. Jessica, I'll send it back to you.